Safe mode on a PlayStation 5 is an option designed to help perform basic troubleshooting on your game's console. So if you experience issues where your console is not able to properly display an image on your television, if you manually change the output resolution being displayed by your PS5, you can try to determine if the problem is related to your game's console, its HDMI cable, or your television. To place a PlayStation 5 into safe mode, we first need to ensure that our PlayStation is powered down. One way to do this is to press and hold down the power button on our console for roughly 3 seconds or until we hear our PS5 beep for a second's time. We now need to wait until the status light on our console goes out. To place our console into safe mode, once again we need to press and hold down the power button. However this time we need to press and hold down the power button for roughly 6 seconds or until we hear a second beep. When we release our finger from the power button, our console is placed into safe mode, and we're asked to connect our controller to our PS5 using a USB cable. After pressing the PS button on our controller, we're presented with the seven options of safe mode. Let's select change video output. Within video output, there are two options, change resolution and change HDCP mode. HDCP mode is a protection system designed to prevent you from digitally capturing the audio and video content being output by your game's console. However, you may need to disable HDCP if you're having problems capturing video footage using a capture card. The other option, change resolution, allows us to manually choose the resolution that we want our PlayStation 5 to output to. When we select Change Resolution, our PS5 will reboot and then display the video resolutions that we can use with the television that we're connected to. While the default option is automatic, it can be useful to try and use a lower resolution if your television is having problems displaying an image. However, it's worth noting that because your PlayStation 5 uses HDMI 2.1, which is a standard that can support 4K resolutions at up to 120 frames per second, if your television also supports HDMI 2.1, but you are not using the HDMI cable that was supplied with your PS5, any visual issues will more than likely be related to the type of HDMI cable that you're using. For this demonstration, we're going to manually force our PlayStation 5 to use 1080p. So after selecting this option, we're once again presented with the PlayStation 5's login screen, which is being output in high definition. <laughs> 